Okay, it's May 22nd, about 10 a.m. on the west coast, and we catch the harp transmitter burning a hole through the clouds again. Uh, this this uh, opening right here should not exist if this was just a plain island. And the, the surface winds are going in this direction. They're very light. The jet stream is going in this direction, but that's, you know, 30,000 feet up. Um, so, uh, maybe I can zoom a little more. We can definitely see something is creating an opening in the clouds, and then the surface clouds are being dragged down to the southeast. And um, haven't seen this for a while. They've been pretty careful to cover that up, but here it is. And this means that they're transmitting pretty much, well, east to northeast. So what do we have east to northeast that might be receiving that billions of watts of HF power? Well, what we have is, let's just assume it's going about in this direction here. <coughs> I have to slow this down. What we have right here, we have some ELF clouds. And one more zoom. We do have some ELF clouds there. Uh, let me just step through and we can watch those evolve. Here's daybreak. And you can see some rounding shape here. And obviously this is a big rain system about to go into New Mexico and then Texas. So here we do start seeing cross hatching and, and lines. Okay, and not only that, but up here in uh, New Mexico, this area right here, let me zoom in on that. Right at daybreak, we see that there's sort of a concentric circles here. And they're still kind of existing. And now that area is now cleared out. And we can still see some little concentric rings off on that side. And a concentric ring down here. So this, is, this was the target of the harp after sunup. They harp that. Oh, look, here's a beautiful ring here. I don't know how they expect people to miss that. But, uh. Oh, too far, too far. Okay. I mean, that's a, that's a nice little ring there. And is there anything in the jet stream that can cause that? Uh. And, you know, just as I've said before, anytime they harp, put the harp energy on an area, it messes up the, the isobars, these lines of equal pressure. And someone has to come in and draw something crazy like this here and put a little dot there. <laughs> so uh, this does not look, uh, surface pressure does not look to have anything that can make those uh, circles. The jet stream certainly doesn't. It's fast from the southwest. So, we do not seem to have any thing that can account for a lot of this. But uh, the reason they're, they're sending that energy right there is because of this tremendous rain that's forecast in this evening. This May 22nd, 8 p.m. is the forecast. And where were they sending the harp? They're sending it right here. And it was down here this morning. So, uh, again, it's... And from the jet stream, moving in this direction, that's going to drag it across Kansas and all these places. But uh, Texas is supposed to get some really nice rain today and for the next couple of days. So I'll believe it when I see it. But... They're actively using the harp to, to shut down that rain. So, again, it's just uh, pretty amazing. They just uh, 
uh, and anybody who thinks, oh, that's just the wind, well, we just got to compare. Okay, we can tell from the clouds, the clouds are really going this direction. And look at this island over here. You know, it doesn't have anything sticking out to the east. This one has something sticking out. It's burning a hole through the clouds to the northeast. So there you go, folks. Another screw up that they allowed the public to see. If they would come clean about this stuff and tell us what they're doing, I'm sure that people would uh, understand, but they're not going to tell anybody. They're not going to. Uh, I suppose this right here is the closest they're going to come to a, a disclosure. A public disclosure and at some higher level of fairness they do have some rules that they play by and by their rule book this is all you need to know to, to prove that this is actually going on so they think that they have now fulfilled their contract for fairness with this public disclosure here um, they don't understand. Uh, humans need a little bit more than that. This is totally not fair. Okay, hope that's interesting. Thanks for watching.